Good morning. Was Jesus crazy? Some in his family thought so. Strange. We're looking at Mark this morning, Mark 3, verse 20 to 30. And uh, we'll go through it rather quickly here. Mark 3, 20 to 30. Then the multitude came together again so that they could not so much as eat bread. But when his own people heard about this, they went out to lay hold of him. For they said, he's out of his mind. And the scribes who came down from Jerusalem said, He has Beelzebub, and by the ruler of the demons he casts out demons. So he called them to himself and said to them in parables, How can Satan cast out Satan? If a kingdom is divided against itself, that kingdom cannot stand. And if a house is divided against itself, that house cannot stand. And if Satan has risen up against himself and is divided, he cannot stand but has an end. Now no one can enter a strong man's house and plunder his goods unless he first binds the strong man, and then he will plunder this, his house. Assuredly, I say to you, all sins will be forgiven the sons of men, and whatever blasphemies they may utter, but he who blasphemes against the Holy Spirit never has forgiveness, but is subject to eternal condemnation, because they said he has an unclean spirit. So there we have it, quite a lot going on here, and people are ascribing to God, to Jesus, the work of, of the demons. So don't ascribe the work of Jesus to the work of Satan. Don't do that. That is a dangerous piece. Um, if it's a work against selfishness, then it's a work of God. But the devil will try to get us distracted, and he'll try certainly to cause us to become very judgmental and saying, making determinations that this isn't from God, this isn't from God, this isn't from God. Sometimes God works in ways that we hadn't thought about. And so we need to let God be God. But we need to be uh, ready to, to say, God, you're doing it your way. Let's pray together. Dear Father in heaven, we thank you for your uh, good watch care over us. We notice that when you're doing a work in the world, that the devils will come and try anything that can be done to discourage us or lead us to confusion. So bless us, Lord, and help us. Help us to be right. And I ask your blessing for those that are uh, watching these devotional thoughts morning by morning, day by day. Every one of us is very much in the spiritual battle, and we need your help and assistance. So bless the listeners, Lord, and give them strength for this day. We ask it in Jesus' name. Amen. God be with you today and give you a wonderful day. If you're getting some spiritual benefit from these presentations, I just encourage you to go ahead and press the subscribe button, and then whenever there's a new item out, you'll, you'll see it when you're on YouTube. So uh, just click the subscribe there if you'd like. But anyway, have a wonderful day. God be with you.